Marines assigned the Fleet Anti-Terrorism Security Team Central Command prepare for the most extreme situations through extensive combat conditioning. This morning we did a little combat conditioning session, all right? So what that does is it warms up the Marines, uh, gets them mentally and physically prepared to carry out the McMap training that we have for them, and also just gets them in that good combat mindset so that they can apply the techniques that they're learning throughout the day in an actual situation. Four striking the pad. Whoever's left over is doing a plank until we switch. A lot of the exercises that, that they're doing, they have to do as a unit, or they have to do with a buddy. And if they don't do them together, you know, in rhythm, then that cohesion falls apart. So that has to build trust. Uh, it builds mental strength and knowing how to work with someone. It's not just all about you trying to get through it, but you have to help your buddies through it and make sure that you stay strong so that your buddy doesn't fail beside you. Reporting for Commander U.S. Naval Forces Central Command, I'm Petty Officer Mike Wright.